Hi, everybody, and welcome back into Wolf's Tavern. I am your host, Wolf of Retro and Wolf, as well as being associated with Geek News Now. So make sure to go check out all of those links down below in the description. And without any further ado, we're going to go ahead and get into this recipe. So I have a very simple recipe for us today, and it's called a swirly noodle taco skillet. So I have all the ingredients right over here. So we have our one pound of meat that we got. We have half of a medium-sized onion. We've already chopped that up. We're gonna need two cups of water, one jar of salsa, one can of green chilies. Both of these, you can choose your heat. So if you want mild or medium or hot, you can do that as well. We have one packet of taco seasoning, about eight ounces of a swirly noodle. You can choose whichever type you want, as well as one can of corn. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna take our meat and then we're gonna add that onion with it. We're gonna brown that meat, drain off that fat, and then we're gonna come right back for the next steps. Okay, so now that we've got our meat all browned with the onion, we're gonna go ahead and get that back on the heat. We're gonna add our two cups of water. Then we're going to go ahead, just put in that whole jar of salsa as well as where we have that whole can of the chilies. And we're going to put in that whole packet of the taco seasoning. We're going to mix this first before we add in noodles. Okay, so we've got this pretty much mixed together a little bit. So then we're just gonna go ahead and add in all of those noodles. We're going to mix this together. Then we're going to lower the heat down to medium, cover it and cook it for about 12 minutes. Okay, so it has been about 12 minutes, and you can see that we still have a little bit of a boil here. And then we're just gonna go ahead and add in that one can of corn. We're going to mix this all together, and then we're going to continue to cook this until the noodles are cooked all the way through. Okay, so we've got this all done. We've got this here. What I like to do, I like to add cheese to the top. I know some people actually will use this as a taco filling, so you can use some tortillas or even breaking up some tortilla chips on top. So now with all of that, there's your swirly noodle taco skillet. And once more, I am Wolf of Retro and Wolf, and we'll see you again next time. Bye.